Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a huge update from Lockheed Martin as they crank up the pace on their F-35 fighter jet deliveries to record levels. If you're curious about high-tech aviation or want to know what's next for one of the most advanced fighter jets in the world, stick around. Let's break down what Lockheed's doing and why it matters on the global stage. Lockheed Martin is moving at warp speed to meet demand for the F-35 fighter jet. After a year-long pause in deliveries, Lockheed's now pushing out 20 F-35s per month, a pace they've never hit before. This is all about catching up on a backlog that piled up during that hold on deliveries. With military forces around the world needing these jets, Lockheed's commitment to this rapid pace is keeping them on track with their production promises. Since the hold was lifted in July, the numbers have climbed fast. Back in June, Lockheed had delivered 990 F-35s. By the end of September, that shot up to over 1,060. In just three and a half months, they delivered more than 60 jets. Initially, Lockheed estimated it would deliver around 75 to 110 jets in 2024, but now, seeing the momentum, they've raised that target to 90 to 110. This means they're likely to keep delivering 15 to 23 jets each month through the end of the year. Now here's why the backlog happened in the first place. The F-35s were being built with the new TR-3 hardware, a critical upgrade that supports advanced features like electronic warfare, new communications, and weapon systems. But the TR-3 software was still being tested. Without it, these jets couldn't hit the skies. After Lockheed proved the software was stable, the government lifted the hold, allowing deliveries to resume. So now, those stored jets are being delivered alongside the newly produced ones to keep the process smooth. Lockheed's approach to managing this backlog has been strategic. The jets that were stored during the hold received regular maintenance and testing, so they'd be ready to go as soon as deliveries resumed. Now Lockheed's releasing those stored jets alongside freshly built ones, aiming to clear the backlog by 2025. With this approach, they're minimizing any production slowdowns while meeting the needs of customers around the world. Looking ahead, Lockheed's not slowing down. They're planning to deliver at least 156 F-35s in 2025. Demand for this jet is still strong among the 19 countries either operating or planning to buy it. Lockheed even marked a milestone quietly in July, with the delivery of the 1000th F-35 to the Air National Guard in Wisconsin. The F-35 program is clearly still flying high, and it'll be exciting to watch how Lockheed continues to expand its reach with one of the world's most advanced fighter jets. If you enjoyed this breakdown and want to see more content like this, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. See you in the next video.